All right, we have to show that the, the function f of z equal to the real part of z is nowhere differentiable, so proof. So we'll use the cauchy riemann equations. So first, um, so let z equal, let's say, x plus iy. So then we can write f of z, well, that's just the real part of z, which is just x. Now, we need to identify u and v to use the cauchy riemann equations. So I'm going to write this as x plus 0i. Okay, so now it's pretty easy to see what u is. So set u of xy uh, equal to x and v of xy equal to 0. So now we'll check. We'll take the partial derivatives and we'll check the cauchy riemann equations. If they don't hold, then we're done and the function is nowhere differentiable. So del u del x, that's equal to 1. Del u del y is equal to 0. Uh, let's see, del v del y, that's equal to 0. And negative del v del x, that's also equal to 0. So these are the same, but that's not enough. These have to be the same, and they're not. So del u del x is not equal to del v del y. So the cauchy riemann equations do not hold. And they don't hold at any point. 1 is never equal to 0. So this always works. This works for every complex number. So since the cauchy riemann equations do not hold at any complex number, f. So f is nowhere differentiable. So to prove a function is nowhere differentiable, one way to do it uh, is to show that the Cauchy-Riemann equations do not hold.